it going guys? Sharblox here. Today we're going to be talking about Roblox head glitches. Now I just want to say this video is different to tricks. These heads are like actually broken. To be honest Roblox head glitches are actually very rare. Most Roblox heads don't really break. Obviously Roblox don't really make much heads in the first place unless it's linked with Arthro. I'm going to show you guys some of the heads that broke in the past and how they ended up looking weird on people's avatars and inside of Roblox games. And I also have have a glitched head to show you guys at the end of this video that is still broken even to this day and it's really funny to see what this head does inside of games when you have it equipped so make sure to watch to the end of this video to see how that works first of all i want to quickly show you guys the past head glitches that i remember because it's kind of funny to take a look back and look at these interesting head glitches and see how they worked so this one was called the stretched head now the thing is you can kind of still do this and i will show you guys that in a second Second, but the main glitch behind this has actually been patched by now. This was a glitch that was working a little bit in 2014. I think it was working in 2015 as well. So a pretty old glitch now. But this one was really cool. And if you wanted to get this working, it was actually free. It didn't used to cost any Robux. And all you had to do was equip the roundy head, which is in fact free. And then when you joined a game, your head would just stretch out and end up looking very strange exactly like this. So you guys might be wondering, well, how do you do this in 2021 well you can actually do this using a ugc item called the squished noob head now it's not exactly free like it used to be because i don't think this glitch will ever be coming back but if you want to do it you can buy the squished noob head for 150 robux and it pretty much looks the same apart from the face it's basically the best recreation of this glitch the next glitch i want to show you guys is one i used to call the marshmallow head now this one was really cool this was a glitch that used to happen in 2018 and basically when you equipped a head called the narrow head which was 75 robux and when you joined a game your roblox avatar's head would go incredibly small so it looks like a marshmallow now this was really funny at the time this was really popular and people were really sad when this glitch got patched the thing is you can still kind of do this it's just not as small if you get some afro heads they look so small on r6 characters that they still kind of give off this effect yes i have to admit it's not as good as the marshmallow glitch but it's pretty much the best we can do the next head glitch involves the headless horseman now the thing is guys this one is still working and this one is incredibly glitchy and it's really funny you can actually ruin the experience of a player's game by doing this glitch and i'm going to be testing it in this video now if you do have headless horseman i would say probably don't do this it is kind of mean you can literally troll players inside of the game i will get onto that in a second so obviously the head with the headless horseman is pretty much the headless head you know it's invisible when you wear this head on your character yes it's still a solid object so if someone jumps on your body they still stand on the invisible head but you can't see it you know it's literally just invisible it's headless it looks pretty cool but the thing with the headless head is it's not completely invisible there is actually a tiny dot now i don't know if you guys can see it i'm just going to enlarge it for you guys as you can see it's literally like a tiny little pixel and because of this you can actually troll people inside of games this glitch was was never fixed. I just want to say a big shout out to Avid Alex or Zero Bid Zero, however you prefer to say your name. He was the one that actually showed me how to do this. And this glitch is currently working in Natural Disaster Survival and many old Roblox games. So what I'm going to do is equip the headless head, join the game, and I'm going to show you guys how you control players. Now, I know most of you guys watching probably don't own a headless head. It is very expensive. However, I know a few of you watching probably do own it. It was out with the headless horseman package on Halloween. And yes, it will be back on sale this year as well. So if you guys want to purchase it, just wait until October. It was 31,000 Robux. So it is very expensive. Also, before I forget, guys, you must turn on R15 mode if you want this glitch to work. Now, what you need to do is go to the game section and you want to find a game called Natural Design disaster survival so i'm just going to find it i think it's probably on my home page actually so there you go natural disaster survival what we're going to do is join the game and i'm going to show you guys how this glitch works 
now we are inside of the game and do you guys remember i was talking about that tiny pixel that tiny dot that was on the headless head well look here it is it's just down here look how weird that looks and you can see it's actually attached to my roblox avatar now the headless head glitch is currently working and it's actually going to be kind of hard for my character to move as you can see my character's kind of glitching about a bit like if i try and walk up the stairs sometimes it's like incredibly glitchy like the map has start glitching a bit this glitch is really messy now i'm going to try and show you guys how this works so how it works guys is this little pixel down here is somehow getting in the way of my character's movements and it's just messing everything up like i said you can spin around you can send players flying it's incredibly glitchy but it is kind of cool and like i said this does work in other roblox games as well like i said you can spin around send people flying it's actually like a troll so let's give it a try here normally if you jump on someone's head and then walk forward a bit you can actually knock them over just like that this guy fell over I thought it would be easier if I just show you guys a montage. So here is a montage of me using the headless head glitch. And as you can see, I'm just jumping on players' heads. They're going flying. I actually found a really good technique. If you jump on a player's head and then you start to spin around, that kind of like little pixel, that little dot, whatever it is, that completely glitches up and it manages to send other people's characters flying. So yeah, it's hilarious. You can literally jump on people, send them flying, basically knock them off the map. I know this is trolling and yeah it is kind of mean I do admit but I just wanted to show you guys this in the video because I did find it really funny it is hilarious inside of games so if you guys do own headless head yourself I guess you can try this if you want to just don't try and troll players too much because it is a bit mean like I said uh, but it's just kind of funny to test out now honestly I don't know if Roblox are going to fix this or not because it's kind of a bit weird like how would Roblox go about fixing this would they have to remove that little pixel from the head head i honestly don't know i guess that's how they would go about fixing it you see this guy right here the guy that i knocked off the tower he actually got really triggered when i knocked him off i'll show you guys his message in a second but yeah i was just testing it out on random games i was just jumping on players see what happens i just wanted to show you guys a quick montage because filming this was kind of long like this is probably like six minutes worth of footage just like crammed down into like one minute yeah you see this guy right here the guy that i knocked off the tower he got really triggered he actually thought i was using an exploit he said this in the chat hold up let me check his youtube i gotta see this oh god he's one of them youtubes bun bun girls god dang jj sploits so he thinks i'm using an exploit which i'm not this guy just got triggered way too easily guys i also just found out you can glitch through windows and walls if you like zoom in to like first person and then start turning around sometimes you just get teleported outside so let's just try it there you go as you can see it works and there we have it roblox head glitches so there aren't many heads which kind of glitch and break anymore like i said roblox have fixed most of them and roblox don't really make much heads unless roblox is making a head for an afro package they don't really make normal avatar heads the headless head is still broken as you could see by this video now this works on older games i don't know if this works on every game but it is pretty cool to test out anyway also, if you'd like to support me and get a limited edition Sharkblocks plush, this is nearly off sale. I will leave a link to it in the description. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.